The government has just published a white paper on the review of the elected presidency. But what exactly is a white paper and what's so special about it? Well, the white paper is a formal policy document issued by the government to explain or discuss matters. The term white paper has been around for years and is known to have originated in Britain. Did you know that besides a white paper, there's also the green paper, which is more a preliminary discussion or consultative document usually issued before the formulation of a government policy. Then there's the blue book, which is for official reports, statistical, government or parliamentary publications, which are presented with a blue cover. The most recent white paper on the elected presidency scheme is the third white paper that the government has published on the topic. The first two white papers on the scheme were introduced in the late 80s and early 90s. The first presented the need for an elected president, while the second further considered the roles of the president and the Council of Presidential Advisers. Now, more than two decades later, this white paper proposes changes to the eligibility criteria, the representation of all races in the presidential office, and amendments to the role and composition of the CPA. For more information on the white paper, please visit this website.